Embedding your Facebook videos on your WordPress website is a great way to connect with your audience directly on your site. And the best part is you can get visitors to follow and engage with your Facebook business page as well. That's why in this video, I'll show you how we can embed your Facebook videos onto your WordPress website in beautiful feeds like this. If you're ready, let's get started. To display our Facebook videos on our WordPress website, we'll use the Smash Balloon Facebook Feed Pro plugin. This plugin lets you create amazing, fully customizable and responsive Facebook feeds for your WordPress website. To get started, you can purchase the plugin from smashballoon.com. Once purchased inside your account, you can find the download link and license key for the plugin. Next, head over to your WordPress dashboard. To install Facebook Feed Pro, go and hover over plugins on the left-hand side and click on Add New. And then go and click on Upload Plugin at the top. Here, you can upload the zip file you downloaded from smashballoon.com. Just like this, and click on Install Now. Once installed, you can go and activate the plugin. There we go, our plugin has now been installed successfully. Before we go and start creating our Facebook videos feed, let's go and activate the license key for the plugin. To activate the license key, hover over Facebook feed on the left-hand side and click on settings. Here, beside license key, we can enter the license key for Facebook feed pro, just like this, and click on activate. Awesome, our license key is now active and we can begin creating our Facebook videos feed. Head over to Facebook feed once again on the left-hand side and click on all feeds. Next, go and click on add new at the top. With Facebook Feed Pro, you have the option to create several different types of Facebook feeds. You can create a feed of posts from your Facebook timeline, a feed of photos from your Facebook page, a feed of videos from your Facebook page, and so much more. In this tutorial, we're going to create a feed of Facebook videos from your Facebook page. So we're going to select this one here and click on Next. Now we're going to have to add a Facebook page as a source to get our videos from for our feed. Click on Add New. And here, beside Source Type, select Facebook Page as it already has as it's set to by default, and then click on connect to a page. Once you've logged into Facebook, it will show you all the Facebook pages associated with your Facebook profile. Select the page that you want to embed your videos from like this and click on next. And on this screen, it's asking us for permission to connect Smash Balloon with your Facebook account. I'd recommend leaving all the settings as is because all it's doing is viewing all the information it needs to display your feed, but it won't be able to make any changes to your Facebook account. So it's completely safe. We can click on done here and proceed. And we've now successfully linked Smash Balloon to our Facebook account. Click on OK here. And back inside our WordPress dashboard, we can now select the page that we want to add to Smash Balloon. I'm going to select this one right here and click on Add. And now we can select this page to add to our Facebook videos feed. Then you can go on this page, you can select from several different templates for how your Facebook feed will look. You have options like the default, simple masonry, widget, large grid, and more. For this tutorial, let's continue with the default template and click on Next. And since we're creating a Facebook video feed, you have two different options to choose from. You can either show all the videos from your Facebook page, or you can show videos from a specific playlist. For this tutorial, let's show all the videos from our Facebook page. It's already selected here, so we can go and click on Next. And now on our screen, we'll see a beautiful preview of our brand new Facebook videos feed. It's showing all the videos that we have on our page called Landscapes We Love, and they're all displayed neatly in this grid. Before we go and embed our feed onto our WordPress website, let me show you how we can customize it. On the left hand side, under the Customize tab, you can go into Feed Layout. Here it gives you several different options to customize the layout of your feed. Currently, it's got the grid layout selected and it shows all your videos in rows and columns like this. Next, we have the list layout, which shows all your videos inside a single column list like this. Next, we have the masonry layout, which shows all your videos in their original sizes like this. And finally, we have the carousel layout, which shows all of your videos in a beautiful carousel, which you can swipe through like this. Proceeding with the carousel layout, you can also customize the number of posts you want to display on your feed. And further below, you can also specify the number of columns you want on desktop and on mobile. To modify, you can simply enter the number of columns you'd like to display right here, like this. Once you're happy with the layout of your feed, go and click on Save on the top right corner. With Facebook Feed Pro, you can also customize the header of your Facebook feed. You have two different options you can choose from. The first one is the visual header, which has your Facebook cover photo and profile photo at the top. The next one is the text header. This is a minimal header design with text that you can customize below. Alternatively, you can also disable the header entirely like this. Once you're happy with your header area, go and click Save on the top right corner. When you finish customizing your Facebook feed, we can proceed to embed it onto our website. To embed our Facebook videos feed, go and click on Embed on the top right corner. Here you'll find a dedicated shortcode for your Facebook feed. Copy it like this and click on Add to a page. Then select the page you want to add your feed to and click on Add. On your page, you have two different options to embed your Facebook feed. The first option is by copying and pasting the shortcode for that feed. Or if you're using Block Editor, you can use our dedicated Facebook feed block like this. And just like that, our Facebook feed has now been embedded onto our WordPress web page. 
Now we can publish the page and check out what it looks like on the front end of our website. And here on our live web page, you can now see our brand new Facebook videos feed. It's loading up all the videos from our Facebook page and it's showing them neatly in this grid layout that we chose earlier. If you click on any of these videos, you can watch them right on your website in this light box view. And at the bottom of our feed, we can load even more videos inside our feed, just like that. And if you want to add your Facebook videos into the sidebar or footer of your website, you can do that as well. To embed our Facebook video feed onto the footer of our website, go and click on Embed on the top right corner. Next, instead of adding our feed to a page, we can go and click on Add to a widget. This brings us into the WordPress widgets menu. Let's add our Facebook feed here. We have the same two options to embed our Facebook videos feed. You can either copy and paste the shortcode for that feed, or you can use a dedicated Facebook feed block like this. And right away, you can see that our new Facebook videos feed has been loaded up into the footer. Let's save this and check out what it looks like on the live website. And now we're back on our live web page, and right in the middle, we can see that first Facebook videos feed that we created earlier. And if I scroll down into the footer, we can see a brand new Facebook videos feed right in the footer. So we've successfully created a Facebook videos feed for our web page and for the footer as a widget as well. If you have any questions about what we covered in this video, please let me know in the comments below. If you have any technical issues with the plugin, please get in touch with our amazing support team. They'd be happy to help you out. And don't forget to subscribe to our channel to learn more about social media marketing tips to help you grow your business. Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you in the next one.